Uh, so welcome back guys. My name is Amlan and in today's Make Knowledge Free campaign we go about looking at how to fix a certain issue. Now if I zoom in the screen you will see that this phone has been detected. I've actually connected the phone using a USB cable onto this PC. And like if you see like the phone has been detected there is this Galaxy M51 which is displaying here. However if I open it I don't see any content of this phone. Which means the phone is simply getting charged. So if I remove the USB cable it all goes and if I simply put in back you will see that the phone gets detected however there is nothing inside so if i see the pc the phone is detected so this galaxy m51 is being shown it is charging however there is no content being displayed on the monitor so how do we fix this so one of the ways to fix this is to turn on usb tethering via the developer options so first let's go ahead and turn on the developer options i head to a settings tap on about phone go to software information tap on build number seven times and prompted for the screen pattern and you can see it says the developer mode has been enabled. Now when I scroll from the top, tap on settings, scroll down, I see developer options. I need to scroll down until I see a certain option which is tethering of hardware acceleration. Just below this I see default USB configuration which means that if the phone is connected to the system using a USB cable, what is it supposed to do? And like you can see, it shows charging phone only. Let me make this to transferring of files. Once I make this transferring of files, now let's see what happens. Now I'm back to the PC and I will put in the USB cable. As soon as I put the USB cable, you will see that the phone is detected. And now if I can zoom in, you will see that both the card and the phone memory is being displayed. So if I double click on this, I can actually see what is inside the phone. So this, what I suggest is one of the best ways of fixing going to the developer options and allowing for USB tethering for transfer of files. Sometimes people have reported the phone itself doesn't get detected. At such times, what you may try doing is change the USB cable. Not all USB cables are capable of transferring files. So you need to purchase a USB cable which allows for transferring of files. So that is called a USB data cable and then use different USB data cable. And once you do that, not only will the phone get detected, but it will also allow for transfer of files. Also, what you can try doing is change the USB port into which you have plugged in the USB part. So if there are certain, say, two USB ports, try putting this into a different USB port. Maybe one of the port has stopped working and maybe the other port will work better. Now you can see the phone has been recognized and it is showing the phone contents as well. Last but not the least, you can try updating the phone device drivers. I, I mean the PC device drivers to detect the phone. For this, you need to click on PC, right click on PC, head towards manage. You will see device manager, head towards device manager. And then here, like the phone is already connected. So you need to tap on portable devices. You will see the phone that's already there. If you see some YOLO thing out here, it means that the phone driver like is not sufficiently capable of detecting the phone. Just right click on this, tap on update driver, tap on browse my device then here let me pick then mtp usb device and then click on next and you will see the drivers are successfully installed and the phone is now detected and the contents are detected as well so updating of drivers can also help in fixing when the phone is simply charging but not allowing for transfer of content if you find today's tutorial helpful kindly consider subscribing and please do share this with your friends click on the bell icon for notifications and also please Donate using super thanks. It means the world to me. Thank you so much.